Hey guys, it's me Rachel and today I'm back with another video for you guys. So today's wig is coming from Beauty Forever Hair and they did send me this around Christmas time so that's why there's all the Christmas stuff. But I just want to do a quick unboxing for you guys to show you guys everything that they sent. And then we're going to get into this wig. So this wig is very different for me. The picture on the website is a little bit darker than this so I was pretty surprised at how light it was. Um, but this is supposed to be a cinnamon brown colored human hair wig in the color number 30 and it describes it as a chocolate brown wig. This one I would describe as more of a like almost kind of a blonde wig. Kind of like if you were to give your wig a bleach bath and then like not color it. So I definitely would have loved to watercolor this wig but I didn't have the time and I wanted to show you guys how it looked straight out of the box. This wig is in the color number 30 like I said. The texture of it is the Jerry Curly. And the length of it is 22 inches. So yeah, the color was a little bit off, but I decided to experiment with it and try anyway. So I did have to change my shirt, as you guys will see later on, because there's just way too many colors going on in this video for this wig. So yeah, one thing that I love about this wig is that it's capable of being completely glueless. So as you guys see me cut the lace, that's when I'm realizing that I can wear this wig with absolutely no glue. I did glue down the sides, so I used the Got To Be Glue um, gel and spray for both sides, but that was literally it, only because they would like fly up if they weren't being held down by anything. But as far as the top part, all the way down until you get to the ears, it was completely glueless, so I absolutely love the construction of this wig. I'm pretty sure I just got the medium or the average size, but it was perfect, so yeah, other than the color being a little bit off. This wig was super cute. I didn't have to like redo the curls or anything. I kind of just left them as is once I saw that I could just use this as a glueless method. So if you're looking for a beginner friendly kind of wig, definitely check this one out. Maybe next time I'll watercolor it or get back into coloring some wigs for you guys because I know I haven't done that since I was like in college. So it's been a few years, but like I said, this wig is from Beauty Forever. I'll leave all the information linked down below as always. And if you guys are interested, check them out. Don't forget to give my video a huge thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And I'll see you guys in my next one.
Christmas.